And one night it got so bad that they took me to the emergency room the next morning thinking for sure that I was having a heart attack. A.B. Milton was relieved to know that he wasn't having a heart attack. Instead, he was diagnosed with shingles, also known as herpes zoster. Shingles is caused by the chickenpox virus. If you've had chickenpox, the virus stays in your body, living dormant in nerve cells. Sometimes it is reactivated, causing blisters and intense pain. The biggest problem with shingles really is pain. The skin lesion is ugly, the patients don't like it, but the skin will get better, the rash will go away. What is often left behind is pain, and the pain can be a very big problem. Patients have pain because the nerve that the shingles virus travel down has been damaged. The damage to that nerve causes persistent pain. The intense pain of shingles forced A.B. Milton to switch from his lifelong passion of playing golf to shooting pool. Taking out the garbage is sometimes difficult on a bad day. But Dr. John Ganan, an infectious disease expert at the University of Alabama at Birmingham, is hoping to save others from the pain of shingles. He's testing a vaccine against the disease. In this national study, participants either get the investigational shingles vaccine or a placebo. This study is based on the observation that older individuals are more likely to get shingles. Why? because we think their immune system begins to fade as they get older. So the idea is to provide a vaccine to immunize older individuals to boost their immunity to the shingles virus so that they won't get shingles during the last 10, 20, 30 years of life. A.B. Milton hopes his symptoms will ease, but for now, he's taking it one day at a time. For UAB Broadcast News, this is Andrea Reber reporting.